Day 20, I spent a day finding out the combination of 20 and inventory, and it just doesn't work. I have a um, custom relationship that I have to display uh, in 20, which I was um, wanting it to be a uh, my primary um, interface. However, 20 cannot display things like uh, putting an inline item in a sales order. So it will display uh, display sales order as a individual item. Uh, so there's a, a table displaying the sales order, and then you have to have another table displaying the inline item. So it's not a table and then uh, a, a inner table, and you cannot um, put that table into a custom item like um, you do in the Notion, right? You can you cannot do that. So 20 does has a lot of input, uh, limitation I just cannot overcome. So I'm going to fall back for inventory plus a front end, uh, custom front end. And I will take a lot of inspiration from um, 20. It has a really good interface design, I, in my opinion, and it has a really great API support. And those two things are uh, quite uh, inspiring for me. For, to develop a um, custom front end for um, what what I need, and uh, inventory will will still be my back end because it has um, a a a very well built um, support for API and a very well built table re um, uh, relationship between tables, and that will be a great um, back end for now. And that will be it. And I think uh, with the almost working front end that I that I have and um, a mapped out relationship, a well fixed relationship that this attempt um, may uh, fixed. And um, with inventory well explored, I think we will have progress, uh, very very fast progress um, in this week. And hopefully we will have a we'll have something to work with uh, at the end of the week. So see you and stay tuned.